Good afternoon, ladies and gentlemen. Welcome back to the channel. I'm Operator Nexus. This is Transport Fever, episode 22. Uh, I hope all of you enjoyed uh, the live stream uh, last episode on Sunday. For those of you who attended, uh, thank you very much. It means more to me than you realize. Um, I know that at least I'm doing something right because people showed up. Awesome. Uh, so we got quite a bit done last time. Maybe not as much as uh, I would have liked to have hoped or maybe not as much as uh, others would have hoped. What is going on here? Are you having problems? What, what's what's your problem? Why are you stopping there? Why did you stop there? Is something in your way? Oh! Shoot! Okay. Okay. Yeah, that's 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 a problem. We're gonna have to fix that. We're gonna have to fix that now. Um, okay. Anyway, so last time around we got uh, all of the the road connections for all of the stuff that's coming in and out of this place. So this is carrying 112. He's still losing us money, but last year it made us 1.9 million, so that's better than nothing. Um, over time, it will start to develop and make more, and I'm gonna, probably going to have to add another train of varying size. And what I might do is I might take that train and cut it in half. Possibly. I mean, it's not a very, that's not a very long train, to be honest. That's only 33 cars. I mean, that sh that's nothing. Anyway, uh, we've got to fix this. Now, this is going to cause problems in the future if we don't fix it now. So as it goes, all of this stuff is, ooh, got to shut that off. Everything coming through this little bridgeway uh, intersection is using one one side of the track for both so anything on this side that needs to come through when this is it yeah it's gonna happen yeah nope nope we're gonna have to fix it right now so let's get to that All right here that's what we want we know we don't want catenary we're still in 1940 as much as there was probably electric we're not using it yet all right what are we gonna do here Clearly. Okay, so one of them is going this. Okay, gotcha. All right, so it just needs to be here then. Well, roughly here. No, 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 no. Nope, don't like it. Um, remind me in a moment, and I will. Rem I will let you know what I was thinking about while the game was loading in before I started the str uh, before I started the video that uh, I should feel horrible about, and in some ways I do, but at the same time, um, you know, I'm still kind of I'm still pretty new, so I have forgiven myself, and I hope that you will too. Um, but uh, yeah, I apologize. Uh, before I decided to try, before I decided to start doing YouTube videos, I was um I was an avid watcher of the Let's Play series from uh you know Colonel Failure and multiple people, and um especially in kind of games like this, and uh, I can't believe that I actually forgot to do this. I apologize immensely. If you're at home and you would like to follow along in this series for this specific map, um. I get well. I guess it wouldn't really matter anymore because they changed that. But anyway, the the if you know how to, uh, I guess I could upload the map. I'll think about that. Anyway, uh, the map seed is my um, YouTube account name, Nexus Gaming. All together, uh, the N is capitalized and the G is capitalized. Everything else is lowercase. And uh, yeah, the other thing is is that I will compile a list of the mods that I'm actively using in this series, and I will put them in the description. Um, from now on uh, I probably won't get around to it in this video, but you can expect to see it in every other uh, Subsequent video after this in the description all the or yeah the list of the mods that I'm currently using in this game and uh, So yeah, I apologize for that, but uh, yeah, we'll get that done um, As soon as possible. Okay, so enough screwing around this one station. What are we doing today? 
Uh, well, okay. Besides fixing this up and making it, you know, plausible, uh, today we are going to focus on, we're moving away from freight and we're going to focus on passengers. So probably what I'm going to do is um, I'm probably going to uh, time lapse some of this and then some of it I'm not because what I'm attempting to do is I'm going to hook up Kempston to Tidworth, from Tidworth to Featherstone to Medlar with Gwesham and then... Uh, well, let's see. Where's the passenger? Okay, the passenger line is that way. Okay, so we'll start a passenger line here. Uh, um, a terminus at Dorchester. And we'll run it out to Kempston. And then to Tidworth, to Featherstone, to Medlar with Wesham. Uh, probably what we'll do. Yeah, to, to Fakenham, to St. Neots. And then into Southall. We probably won't get this all done today, obviously. But that's what we're going to focus on over the next few episodes is passengers. So I hope you're ready for that, folks. Uh, and so uh, let's get it underway.
Alrighty then, welcome back, ladies and gentlemen. Uh, so, that's that connected up. We're not going to get around to connecting up the last two towns, we just don't have the time. Um, but, we do, we are going to put five trains on this line, because it requires five trains to be on this line, in order for it to be profitable. Now, for the first four or five years, we're going to be taking a hit uh, from this train, because it's going to be costing us about... Uh, well, actually, we're not going to be... We might not take a hit. Five trains is 780... Sorry, I'm yawning. Urgh, stretching, rather. Um, five trains is $780,000 a year, so that's roughly 1500 per two. It's actually a little over 1500 per two. Um, so... 1500 I'm sorry. $1.5 Um... 
So actually, we're not going to take a hit. It's going to be less than $5 million total um, that we're going to be taking as a loss on the line as a whole, at least for the first few years until it gets bedded in. Now, <coughs> excuse me. what we could do is we could take a few minutes while that one's running to um, running around for the moment. We're going to kick this into high gear so we can get these trains moving. Um, we will do a ride along for at least part of the route, uh, probably on the last train. But in the meantime, I'd like to get some passenger routes up um, in these towns so that we can, you know, haul some more, haul some more of the sheeple uh, to the, the train stations um, so they can go and spend their money and, uh, Things that they don't on things that they don't really need. So I'm gonna use these standard stations because it's still pretty early. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. And we'll say. Probably set up three lines. Probably have time to set up three lines. Alright, so this is going to be... Dorchester. Hopefully I spelled that right. Uh, Dorchester Commuter. Did I spell that right? Sure did. Alright, you know me. Well, if you do know me and following my channel, you know that this is a passenger line inside the city, so it's going to be green. So we're going to go one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. All right, now there's that's ten, so I'm going to put uh, probably six vehicles. We'll start low, one, two, three, four, five, six, because there ain't gonna be too much demand, I don't think, right in the beginning. This is Dorchester. Now you can get on the purple line. Where's that other train at? Oh, he's already over there. He needs to stop. We weren't paying attention. Actually, no, he'll be fine. He's got two more towns he has to hit. Actually, no, he won't be fine. He needs to stop. He needs to stop where he's at. No, 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 no. You, you need to stop, sir. At least for a moment. Until this train gets to, like, at least between these two, uh, Kempston and Tidworth, you need to stop. You're right there. You're not picking up nobody. You can turn around and leave. And we can go over here and do this side. Back to passengers, grab this. And so we're going to go out to the right. One, two, three, four, five, six. Seven. We're going to go between inside, be, right? We're going to go from here and go take this, this, um, the neighborhood route, route because I really don't want to be blocking these guys from dropping off their stuff. And this is going to be Kempston commuter. Nice planes. You can take off now and you can start taking off. All right, Kempston commuter, this is going to be green, and it's going to be one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. And we'll probably put eh, five or six vehicles on there. One, two, three, four, five, six. And this is going to be Kempston commuter. And then this is going to be Tidworth Commuter.
That doesn't look right, but I hope that I spelled that right. <laughs> it just doesn't look right. I think it is, though. I'm pretty sure it is. I think I've just... I've, I've spelled it and typed it out so many times in this game that it probably just looks wrong to me. Um, if you guys are familiar... Um, you know how, like, if you say a word so too many times, it starts to sound like it's not, like, a real word? Like, it do the word doesn't make sense to you because you've said it too many times? That's where we're at with the, uh, the whole commuter thing with me. Yeah. That's pretty much where it's at, folks. I'm gonna delete this back. I'm sorry, I didn't mean to make anyone homeless, but I did mean to make you homeless. Because... The how your house is not as important as this train stop or is this bus stop sorry uh, you can rebuild now as long as you can build around All right, so this is gonna oop, gotta put the stops in first so this is gonna be one two three that's quite the corner Four, five, six, seven, eight. Okay, so this one's only going to get five or six. It's going to get six uh, cars. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. And, oh, oh auto save. Thank you. Thank you. Appreciate that. Nine. Um, typically how I do this is I take the number of stops that I have and I put usually vehicles on there that are two less than what how many stops it has. So if it has ten stops, usually eight vehicles I put on there. And I usually do that to keep them from bunching up with uh, the rest of the other traffic that's running in the game so that, you know, they're not... They're not all showing up at the station at the same time, and one of them's getting a full load, the other, no, the second one's getting half a load, and then the next two aren't getting anything. Um, so that's mainly why I do that. I don't just like train fever. You don't, I don't just throw a bunch of them on there. A lap, and it would cost, you know, not that they cost m any money, I mean, they do, but nothing that's gonna hurt us. What do we got this year? We're, uh, oh, it's the beginning of the year. We made three, eighteen point nine million the year before, and three point three million last year. But that's because we bought a lot of stuff. Um, construction costs are 500000 uh, Running costs are forty. Well, I guess we've lost some money because largely due to the fact that we have put in a lot more lines that have not really started to profit yet. Um, the other side of the map, all the fuel ro the fuel routes and stuff haven't really started to profit. But uh, we're not losing money. I mean, we're still making money. That's good. We're still in the green, folks. Everything is fine. All right, I'm going to pause you. I'm going to say one, two, three, four, five, six. We'll just do six. And you're going to go on the... The Tidworth commuter. All right, where is the other train at? Any of the other trains back here yet? No. But this one is on its way back, which is why I paused it. Because he only has one town to go before he starts hitting this one. And, oh, there's still two trains left. Darn. Oh, I'm not really, I've really not been paying attention. All right, let's see where they're, where they're at. Why is there two left? I didn't know there was two left. Okay, so you're coming back. You're going that way. You're coming back from that way. And you're already right there. You need to stop. And yeah, you're good. And you need to get on the purple line. Go. Might have to stop. Yo, you picked up 26 passengers. You haven't made any money yet, but I'm not I'm not, not expecting you to make any money for a little while. 
I'm gonna, I'll let you get to the next station, then you're gonna have to, or just outside the next station. Now we actually have to watch and pay attention to what's going on, otherwise we're gonna find ourselves in a pickle. go now. You need to stop. Because he just dropped off over there. And you need to get on the purple line. And you're all right out of here, so... you go. And you're all right out of here. So, you're probably not going to pick up much, are you? Oh, you had nine. There was nine waiting. That's not too bad. Oh, look at that view. I'm going to take a shot of that. Holy crap. That's a nice, that's a nice shot. Okay. Well, there's a farm over there to the left, or at least it looked like kind of like a barn or something. I like those mountains over there to the left, the snow mountains. I'm already cold thinking about it. Hello. Goodbye. That was really close. That train was really too... They are not far enough apart, and they won't separate... They won't space themselves out like the trucks will. I don't know why, but it's just not set up that way. I didn't realize these um, stations had catenary. But it's okay. I guess it's only fitting because we are coming up on 1940 or something. So it is getting pretty close um, to where we can start. Uh, we could start using electric. I don't think... I mean, I think there were diesel trains in the 80s. So it, we have to have already passed the electric age, at least the start point of it. Um, next episode is going to primarily focus on probably airports we do need to get a couple of airport we need to get a central airport established and then we need to start passing uh flying in passengers from other parts of the world to the central airport and then they can go off to you know what what is available you know largely right now on the network um probably going to throw a shipping lane down one of these rivers in that in the next episode as well um but this is a nice passenger route it's like five cities that got connected up today in this episode so that's not too bad um so yeah next time around we're going to be focusing on airplanes and uh, a shipping route for you ship fans and then uh, we will discuss what we're going to do after that so that's going to wrap this up thank you very much for watching uh i have been nexus if you enjoyed this one please leave me a thumbs up and uh, if you want to see the next one, make sure to hit, you hit the bell so that you don't uh, miss anything. And hit the red subscribe button if you have not done so already. If you've made it this far and you've not hit the red subscribe button, I tend to wonder how, how that has happened. But anyway, uh, thank you very much for watching. And I will catch you in the next one. Peace out.